Hey there, it's Brooks here from documentsnap.com. And today this video is by popular request and it's about how to use the distribute by keyword functionality of ScanSnap Organizer to distribute the keywords of multiple documents. I've done a video on this before and this is a follow-up to that. In the video I did before, I was showing how extracting keywords from a PDF works and how ScanSnap Organizer can distribute it using those keywords. But in my previous video, I just did it for a single sheet and I had requests to do it for multiple documents at once. So that's what this video is all about. So I'm not going to go through the entire mechanics of how to scan and extract keywords out of a document because my first video shows that, which you can see a link to here. But I'm going to take you through quickly how to do it for multiple documents. So you can see here that I've got three pieces of paper and each of them has a different word highlighted. The first piece of paper has the word Vancouver highlighted, the second PDF has the word materials highlighted, and the third PDF has the word scan snap highlighted. And just to be sure, let's flip here and go down to scan snap organizer, or sorry, scan snap manager. We'll choose scan button settings. And on the file option tab, we're making sure that we have this checkbox set the mark text as a keyword for the PDF file checked. And I'm going to choose all mark sessions. So we've got that set. So we're good to go. So let's start scanning some of these pieces of paper and see what happens. Okay, I've got the paper loaded in the scanner. So I'm going to hit the scan button now. And it's running through and we'll let all three pages run through. Okay, and all three pages are through. And so now it's going through and it's recognizing the text in each page and it's done. So we've got three pieces of paper here and they should each have keywords. So let's check them out and make sure that they do. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through and before we set up our distribution, we're going to go through and make sure that all the keywords are okay. This is an optional step. Um, I do kind of recommend it just to make sure that what the ScanSnap has created keywords for is what you think it has. So if I click on the first one and hit edit keyword, you can see I've got the keyword ScanSnap there. Great. Let's go to the second one, hit edit keyword. And yep, there's Vancouver. And if we needed to edit any of these, we can always hit, hit the edit or add if it hasn't given us what we thought it, it did. And then we'll hit cancel here and we'll check the third one. And yep, that has materials, so we're good to go for that as well. So I'll hit cancel and we're ready to go. All right, so now that we've got our documents ready and we know the keywords are okay, let's click here to distribute by keyword. And what we're gonna do is we're going to change the distribution condition. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna create some distribution conditions that will move these documents around. And so let's take the first word, which is scan snap. So I'm gonna hit add here. So we want to say any document that has the word scan snap highlighted in it. And remember, it has to be a keyword, not just a word in the document. And we'll say character string is scan snap. And we want that to go, I just called it dest destination one for our example. So we're going to hit OK. So now anything with the word hi scan snap highlighted should go to that destination one folder. Let's take the next one and we'll just to show that they can be different, I'm going to call this rule name YVR and say anything with the word Vancouver highlighted in it, that goes to destination number two. And finally, just to show, we'll do the third one, which is material. And anything with the word materials highlighted in it will go to destination three. So you can see here we've got our our tests here, destination one, two, and three. So we're gonna hit okay. And now we don't even really need to highlight anything, though we could. I'm just gonna hit distribute by keyword. And I'm gonna say distribute. And it's going through, and hopefully it's moved things where they're supposed to go. So if we click here on destination one, and we open this up, That's the document that had scan snap in it. And if we go to des 
Destination 2. That's the one with Vancouver in it, so that's great. And Destination 3 should be Materials, so let's see if it is. And yep, that's the one with the word Materials in it. So that's how you can create different rules for ScanSnap Organizer and have it just run on a bunch of, of documents, even though they may have different words and stuff like that. ScanSnap Organizer should move them around based on the keywords that are in the file. For more Going Paperless tips, head on over to documentsnap.com. Thank you so much.